And there's no doubt about it. We have rain everywhere to begin your Monday morning at 445. Today is a storm track five weather alert day. Last week the weather was quiet all week long. This week will be quite different across our area. We have wet pavement all across the board for this morning. And I noticed on the interstates coming into work this morning here at KCTV five, a lot of spots where the water was ponding on those interstates as well as you're moving through that morning routine. I just pad that extra travel time. I grabbed the rain gear. You're going to need it not just this morning but even into this afternoon across our area. Right now we're at 48 degrees and I do think we're going to see readings into the 50s. That'll happen early this afternoon and then we'll begin to fall just a bit more in terms of temperatures across our area. The latest look of your storm track 5 live power Doppler. It is hard this morning to find a spot where we do not have rain falling. We have widespread areas of scattered showers and even some pockets along I 35 north of the river where we do have some moderate rain falling just north of Lexington, not too far off from Kearney this morning. And I do expect that this rain is going to continue almost the entire day. Here is the very newest update of your storm track by forecast track 7 a.m. for our morning rush hour. And it's these bubbles of yellow that you see that have me concerned with their travel times. Once we get towards the heart of our morning rush hour about 7 to 8 o'clock this morning, that's moderate rain that's expected across our area as we're moving through the next several hours by the lunch hour. Not much changes in terms of our rainfall chances as we're heading into this afternoon. Here is a change and for the first time in quite some time we have not only rain in the forecast, but even a couple thunderstorms that could develop, especially on the east side of our viewing area on the Missouri side of the state line. This is a look at five o'clock tonight, and if you do have outdoor activities, maybe sporting events with the kids after your work day and after school, these are the thunderstorms we're going to be watching that could impact some of your plans for tonight. Then as we're heading towards after sunset, I do think that we're going to begin to quiet down weather wise for one day. The latest update to your storm track 5 security bank 7 day forecast. We are dry for tomorrow with a high of 56. Then I have isolated light rain chances in the forecast for Wednesday and Thursday as well. All eyes looking ahead to the weekend. I do have a storm track 5 weather alert posted for Saturday. Joe and Gina, you see that stuff falling with the rain? That is the chance of seeing snow mixing in with the rainfall as we're looking ahead to our next weekend. We've had a couple of good weekends here and it looks like Mother Nature is going to remind us that winter may not be over. Yet. Say it ain't snow. Mm.